Hi people, what's going on? Heinz Ward is about to be released by the Pittsburgh Steelers. Heinz Ward is 35 years old. He spent 14 seasons, every season of his NFL career with the Pittsburgh Steelers, and they're going to let him go. They've just informed him that they're going to let him go. My first thought is this. It's so ironic that fans whine and complain when players hold out and demand more money. They always say this, oh, they should honor the contract. You sign the contract, you should honor it. Why are those same people silent when players get let go by teams? When teams say, oh, this contract, crumble, let's not honor that. Let's forget about this. This never happened. It's not working out for us. Therefore, it's over and done with. Where are those same people to get on their soapbox and throw a hissy fit when teams don't honor a contract that they agreed to? Where is everybody when that happens? Hey, all I'm saying is this, be consistent. If it rubs you the wrong way that players don't honor a contract, fine, just don't be silent if a team does the same thing. Secondly, this is a good move by the Steelers. Heinz Ward is 35 years old. His best days are behind him. His numbers were drastically down. He wasn't a focal point of the offense. It's better to just move on with the young emerging receivers. And the last thought is this, even with that being said, I still think Heinz Ward is a Hall of Famer. A thousand catches, over 12,000 yards, 85 receiving touchdowns, and I would say the best blocking wide receiver the game has ever seen. It's not just receiving yards, it's blocking, opening up holes, being a physical player. I think the most physical wide receiver the game has ever seen, for a guy his size, that's saying a lot. And when you lead the Steelers, and you're the all-time leading receiver, that's saying something. They've got a few guys in Canton, Lynn Swan, John Stallworth. And when Heinz Ward statistically is the best receiver ever, I know it's a different era. He's a heck of a player. Only four Pro Bowls, so he's a little bit of a borderline guy. But I would put him in. What do you guys say? I'm Brian No, and that's a no-brainer.